Happy Monday! We're back from home time. <laughs> it's still in Texas. Still in Texas. <laughs> we are up, heading out though. Yes, we got a load. Ooh, don't hit that handle. Oh my gosh, this woman <laughs> slammed her finger in the door. We were checking out of the <coughs> RV park at the lake yesterday, and I put the dogs in the truck and I shut the door and my finger got caught. I don't know if you can see it, but yeah, I got it good. It's uh <sighs> It's swollen and it hurts. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty bad. She was crying and Oh God. Yeah, it I was bleeding was... all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> it, was, it was not we were hooking up the R V. Yeah. So Jason was in the truck. Yeah. In the Ford. And I was like, Ah he didn't hear me. I didn't hear her and then I see her out the window all crying like a little Oh my gosh, it hurts so bad. <laughs> but we had an awesome home time. We did. We had a really good time. Uh the, like what the week Weekend we got home we had some friends that were in the texas area and they came and stayed out at the lake with us and yeah over the first weekend yeah and because actually we were only planning on staying home until like Tuesday. over the weekend yeah. yeah and then we decided just to take the whole week yeah but it was much needed yeah, it was it nice was. it, was, it nice was nice to stay in the airstream we got the airstream picked up uh, yes that's right our last vlog yeah we left off before we didn't know if we were going to get delivered um, Thursday, a Thursday night, we got delivered in Fort Worth, and then we yeah. headed down to Waco, got our Ford Friday morning, went up back to Fort Worth to pick up the Airstream, and yeah, it was really nice, really nice. We rented a pontoon boat while we were home. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Oh yeah, while our friends were here. I've never driven a boat before, so <laughs> it was it was fun to do. It was so fun. We did fun. some pulling behind the, in the tubing, and yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah, that was fun. It was a blast. We yeah. had a really good time, but it went by so fast because we only had it for four hours and golly the time went by fast yeah yeah but it i think it, i think that was because we rented jet skis from these same folks too yeah, waco lake rentals yeah we and uh i think so the, the jet skis seemed like they lasted longer i think so just Be i think we we're having more fun on the pontoon boat yeah whereas the jet skis you just drive around all the yeah. everywhere and you kind of oh, they're fun too yeah they're fun too <laughs> but after like two hours you've already seen the whole lake and <laughs> yeah uh, at least the pontoon boat you get to hang out we had lunch we brought you we know, brought uh, the babies we they, brought the puppies and abby did really well tyson was a little scared yeah i mean yeah. he did fine but yeah, yeah, i yeah. think if we did it more often it's just you know he's always skittish about yeah, everything yeah but abby took to it really well she did she was roaming the boat like it was she free was. range she didn't care <laughs> she didn't care we were bouncing on choppy water she was just all walking around looking for something to eat off the ground yep and, <laughs> like and, she always does yep and they got to go in the lake we gave them we took them out and with us in the lake they got a little yeah little they didn't oh. neither one of them like that no. <laughs> we, where our spot was at the lake we actually could walk down and go swimming right off the shore and we took abby and she was swimming back and forth to us but she kept wanting to get out of the water she, she, she was only swimming back and forth to us because we were in between the shore <laughs> <laughs> where she wanted to go yeah but yeah she was it was fun but let's tell you about the load we got we got a load yeah so we picked up here in texas and we are heading to california our favorite place yes a little over 1700 loaded miles one piece at 382 pounds yep Deliver Wednesday morning. Deliver on Wednesday morning and Northern California. I haven't made no calls to anybody out there, so not yet. I'm uh, she's getting ready to take over, so we'll I'll start doing that, making some phone calls and stuff like that. So. Yeah, so we're excited. We nice got this little run. Yeah. yeah, yeah, nothing fancy, but no, but a good run. Gets good us going. Run to get, gets us going. Get, get, get us started back after having a week off. Yeah, yeah. The, the the first run's always the hardest. I think we've said that before. Oh, getting back be on the sleep schedule. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. <laughs> So yeah, get oh, back on the filming schedule too because we haven't been filming. Yeah, and... so yeah, sorry there were no videos last week, but we just wanted to enjoy the home time. I know yeah. you guys understand that. We did that. do the steak, which I'm sure has come out. That'll probably come out, yeah, before this. So we, you guys have probably uh, already seen yeah, that. I yeah, I don't know if it'll come out before or after. You gotta it just edit that up for this week. It. Yeah, you got to get it up for yeah, this week because yeah. we don't have nothing this week. Yeah, we're excited about we that. Something yeah. we did that it was a lot of y'all probably think it's a little crazy, but it was some 
special for us for our anniversary it was, for it next was, month. It was. It was. It was a nice little treat for ourselves. Yeah. And but before we end this clip, um, <coughs> so we have a friend who's a fellow trucker. He's actually a Canadian trucker. Yeah, Eric. His name is Eric. Yeah. He's been following us, gosh, for a many, long many moons, time. Many moons. We met him couple years ago. Yeah, it's probably been two, three, maybe even four maybe, years ago. I don't know. It's been a long time. Uh, probably two to three. Probably about two, yeah. Maybe he, he'll remember, but I yeah. don't even remember. Was that a Petro in... It's Salina. Salina, Kansas. Yeah, in Salina, Kansas. Yeah, yeah we met him in person. He bought, and a, he bought Starbucks. a Starbucks. Yeah, and, uh, oh, yeah. yeah. But he's, he, yeah, he does tractor trailer. He actually does flatbed heavy haul. Yeah, he? yeah, yeah, yeah. He does some pretty cool, cool pictures on Instagram, too. Yes, he does. Yeah. Put well, his Instagram up, but anyway by the time you see this his birthday was this past saturday and we wanted to wish him a very happy birthday happy birthday to you sir it yes. was awesome me i hope we run into you again I sometime know. he was such at, a cool dude when we were um where did we stop albert lay oh yeah albert he lay. was there he was when there. we, we passed there he seen when the we... video and was like oh i was there <laughs> but yeah so happy belated happy birthday, birthday happy by the belated. time you yeah. see this we yeah. hope you had and not only that he, I think it's been almost a year now, or why at a year, owner -operator. he made the jump as an owner operator and yeah. bought his own truck and yeah. has been doing yeah. that and been doing really well. Yeah. And gosh, we, he's a great guy and we wish him, wish you all the best, Eric. I hope you're yeah. watching happy this. Happy birthday to you, sir. He, he bought happy a beautiful late birthday. truck. Yeah, yeah. So happy birthday and happy almost one year anniversary owner operator. <laughs> 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 but yeah, we wanted to, to do that because he's, he's a really cool guy. Yeah. And you're better half contacted us and let us know she let the cat out of the bag <laughs> oh my gosh but yeah so we're doing our driver swap gonna let these babies out yep and i'm taking over and back at it we'll see how much sleep you get tonight probably not a lot probably not a lot it's gonna be rough for me all right all right Tuesday from California. California. <laughs> we made it to California. Yeah. Not to our drop yet. Yeah. We are just outside of um, Coachella. Is that where we're at? Yeah. <laughs> Up on top of the hill. Getting ready to come down into Coachella. Uh, off the I-10. I-10. We still got, how far do we have now? Probably five something. Yeah, about five something. 500 about five, miles. 520 miles. Yeah. So we'll get there tonight. Mm -hmm. I'm taking over. I'll get us the rest of the way there. Oh, oh gosh, yeah, whip, <laughs> whipping me. <laughs> always, that's for, always that first day back. From always, after vacation. always, that's the worst one. It is. No, and not even just back from vacation, from being off a couple of days too yeah. on the weekends. But yeah. Um, yeah, it was, it was all right. Yeah, I'm ready to hit the hay. Are you? And we still need to fix that air conditioner back there. <sighs> Just for when the truck is running. When the truck is running. Rooftop the air rooftop. is working perfectly fine. We gotta do the when, vent though. Yeah, it's a uh, HVAC system for when, it's the bunk HVAC, I mm -hmm. guess you would call it. Um, I've talked about it uh, a couple weeks ago, the the ducting, it just needs re reducted. Yeah. And I think I'm gonna put them all on one side, put all the ducting on one side, so I'll, I'll show you guys. <laughs> I'm going to improve the airflow. Yeah. We had the same problem with our Airstream, too, while we were home. Oh, my gosh, we did. Didn't we? Yeah, it we, we did. It was, it was a, we got it back from the shop. It was 100 degrees out um, the first day we got it back, and the coolest uh, air conditioners could keep it was like 90 degrees inside. And, and we like, have dual air conditioners in the Airstream. And we asked Airstream to look at the air conditioners when it was in the shop. So one thing we ended up doing was that, with that was of course improve airflow yeah um the, it's a ducted ceiling uh, uh rooftop 
air conditioning, but the the registers at the ends of the fen or ducting, they were just too restrictive. Not enough air coming out of them. Yeah. And it was causing them to back pressure and freeze and. Yeah, the the. We I, pulled all the registers out of the whole RV, and the rest of the week it kept at 70 degrees inside there. Or cooler at night, yeah. So just improving airflow increased it that much. Um, so I'm pretty sure increase, uh, improving this airflow back here. Messing up our lighting, homie. <laughs> <laughs> Darn uh, truckers, don't they know we're vlogging here? <laughs> so, well, I'm gonna improve the airflow. That's yeah. It's just as simple as that. Just in, improve the airflow. Yeah, That's we've been we talking do. about doing it, we're just, just it's doing it. It's amazing what how how much things get better when you increase airflow. I know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I've been talking a bunch about it. I, we even bought the ducting for it, some spare uh, duct tube from uh, Home Depot, which I do think I got the wrong size. I think it's three inch, and I bought four inch. I'll double check it, but Home Depot does have three inch too. So mm -hmm. if we have to get pick up some three inch, we'll do that. But yeah, I think I can improve it. Yeah, I think so. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. He's going to go lay down. I'm going to go lay I'm down. Gonna jump I'm going to snuggle with my baby. Oh, yeah. They're ready to snuggle. You ready to snuggle with daddy? Yeah. They yeah. are. We let them out earlier. We let them out. So. And... No. <sighs> All right. Let's, let me knock out the rest of these miles. We'll get delivered first thing in the morning. We did call an agent. There's been a We've, load coming over the last yesterday and today. Yeah. They're trying to get it picked up. It's actually today. in Southern California, but we're delivering Northern yep. California. Yep. Um, we did call them though, so they wanted it. They wanted it picked up yesterday. They, uh, they that wasn't happening. So then they changed the date for today, and they're already sending it out and. I figured I'd call on it. Yeah. Say, hey, we're delivering in Northern California tomorrow. I could be down to Southern California tomorrow afternoon if that works for you guys. Probably late if, afternoon. If not, that's fine. But yeah. And it's worth deadheading for. Yeah. So we'll see. Yeah, we'll and see. If not, we'll see. I'm. I'll be watching and listening to see if anything. And I'm else shutting comes my in. ringer off, and yeah. agents can call your phone. Yeah, they can call me, and I can <laughs> hash it out. Hash it out. <laughs> negotiate it. <laughs> All Come right, on now, that's too cheap. Yeah, right. All right. Be like, oh no, my husband would be mad if I took that. There you that go. Price. Put it off it on me. Yeah. Hey, you always gotta well, blame it on somebody blame, else. Blame right? it on somebody else. Put the blame else. on somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I do. Yeah. Uh, oh, I'm I'm sorry. My wife's over here shaking her head. No, I can't. We can't take that run. <laughs> yeah. So all right, well, we'll get to put you guys probably after we get delivered tomorrow. Go. Cool. I'm all masked up. Yeah. Because we just went in and had lunch. And we had to wear a mask. We had to wear a mask. <laughs> got to wear a mask in everywhere you go now. Everywhere you go. Oh my gosh, man. So we got delivered. <laughs> yes. We, that was went smooth. Got there last night. Yep. Had so, parking. Had good night's sleep. Yeah. Today we, we've been running around. We went to Camping World, got a different shower head. Home went Depot. to Home Depot, got the three inch venting and <laughs> vent tubes and stuff like that. So to fix the a the bunk the AC, bunk AC. Hopefully, which, yeah. I don't know if you can see. There's a bunch of crap back there. I'll today. probably do this weekend. We do have another load lined up. Picks up tomorrow. Yeah. So you'll find out about that in the next vlog. Yeah. No. And, but yeah. yeah, really good run. They actually called us about it yesterday. <clears throat> they did. Called I, and talked to you. Jason was sleeping, and yeah, he's got it where he turns his phone off when he's sleeping, and he, on his voicemail it says, you know, 
if they can get a hold of him, call my number. So the agent called and he told me about the load and I was like, oh, you know, let me call you back because it was right around when Jason was going to be getting up anyway and I wanted yeah. to run it by him. Yeah. But <coughs> it, me. it woke me up in the process of them talking and I got up and I heard it was going to Denver. I was like, hell no. <laughs> yeah. But that's all you're going to find out. You got to wait till the next vlog to yeah, find out all yeah, about yeah, it. Yeah. But anyway, he called us back today and we'll talk about it tomorrow what happened. But yeah. Well, yeah, in the next in vlog. In the next vlog, which will you be say tomorrow. A, two and days, tomorrow for us. Two days two for days you guys. Two days for you. <laughs> yeah. We also stopped at Bed Bath & Beyond. Got a new blanket covered her because yeah. Abby puked. Abby puked all over the one we got. Yeah, I mean, and that's not why I <laughs> wanted a new one. Jason doesn't really like the one that I picked out. I don't like the color. And um, when we were home, I found a new comforter for the Airstream bed that I really, really liked. So we decided to get the same one for in here. So we stopped and got that. Oh, telephone call. Been getting a lot of calls. We have been for stuff, but this one's a junk one. <laughs> <laughs> we're up in uh, Sacramento. Yeah. We are, like I said, we just finished eating lunch. We went to Logan's Roadhouse. They don't have dine-in, but they have outdoor seating. So we were able to sit outside and eat. So dine-out? Yeah. <laughs> Would that be called dine-out? Outside dining. We I still guess. had a waiter, a, mm -hmm. a waitress who helped us and mm. refilled our drinks. and. Which, <laughs> need yes. some hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer up. <laughs> I love these little spray hand sanitizers. Well, I got these at, I don't know, Whole Foods or something. I, I picked some up while we were home at HEB too, but I love these because you can put them in your purse. We keep one on each side in the truck. And yeah. I just refill them with hand sanitizer when they run out. So those are nice. We got an email today. We did. From oh, Landstar. Oh, yeah. Our three-year anniversary with Landstar. It was actually last month. Yeah. <clears throat> got a frog in my throat. <laughs> Ribbit. Error. Um, yeah, our three year safety anniversary. We've been yeah. with Landstar three years and we had um, no safety issues over the past year. So we get to go on and pick out, I guess we get something. The first year we got. Oh, really? Yeah, the first year we got um, jackets. Or no, yeah. the sweatshirts. Sweat jackets. Something. We didn't get anything last year. I don't know if they do it every year or every couple of years, but we got an email. So we got to go on there and see what we get this year. That's pretty cool. Yeah. We'll, have to, we'll show you guys what we pick. I think that's cool that they do that. Because when we were with Panther, they didn't. We got, we got a jacket after, what, our first year, and then that was it. I can see how some people would think it's cool. I just think it's a waste of money and just pay us more. <laughs> pay us the money. And just just hey, give us the money. Hey, but I think, it, I think after, what is it, 10 years, you get a cruise? I mean, you get a cruise. Or if you choose not to go on the cruise, you get $100. <laughs> I'm saying, like, you got to take the cruise. You got to take the cruise. Get the yeah, value because yeah, the cruise no. is more than 100 bucks. Yeah, the cruise is more than 100 bucks, but. Yep, but. I don't know. I've just always been the opinion of. I don't care about all that extra stuff companies do because I know what they're doing it for is they're doing it for image to make themselves look good, which I guess is all right. I mean, I, I understand both sides of it. I'm just like, pay the people who do the work the money, pay them more. As a bonus, that would be nice. I think that would make image look way better, you know, yeah. but I don't know. That's... I do appreciate, though, that they do that because there's a lot of, like I said, Panther never did anything. They had the driver rewards thing, but you had to get a certain amount of miles. Yeah. And, but I, I just think it's nice that they do a, do it for appreciation for the drivers. I mean, yeah, it's not a lot, but it, it's cool. It's cool to be appreciated, whether you think it is or for appreciation or not. <laughs> that's my opinion. That's I, I know that's just grumpy Jason's me opinion. The, yeah, the grumpy, I'm like, pessimistic. Uh, yeah, I'm well, not... I wouldn't say pessimistic. I'm pretty <laughs> optimistic, but for the I, most I, part. I tend to look at the pessimist stuff too. Yeah, where I'm. I look at both sides. I'm the happy go lucky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, I think that's why we get along so well because we are pretty opposite in that respect. But. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, guys, we are fixing to head to the 49er. 49er. Favorite spot up here to stay. Yes. I think it's about 16 miles from where we're going to be picking up in the morning. Stay there for the night. See uh, if we can get a short power spot. Yeah, we should be able to. Hey, man, the temperature oh up here gosh. is so nice. Oh, my gosh. It is so amazingly nice. It was uh, 50 degrees this morning yeah, when we woke up. Yeah, I needed up. a jacket. 
<laughs> Hello. Big contrast from just spending the week in hot Texas. Yes. Five heat index. Every day, and, night in the uh, high 70s, like. And sitting outside here was nice. To yeah. Eat. It yeah. Wasn't, it wasn't yeah. hot. Yeah, really nice. I it's can getting, live. I'm sorry. It is getting warmer right now. Well, plus we got the truck all closed up. We had the. <clears> the, the, the the little, little windows open and the fan going for the babies while we were out eating but we yeah. got it all closed up now and it's getting warm it's starting to warm up a little it is but yeah first load back in the books got another one lined up which you'll find about in the next find out about in the next vlog we're gonna go ahead and close this one here yeah start Let's the next one with this next load cool stay tuned all right thank you guys as always for watching and subscribing and tell our next video peace love and expedite <laughs>